In 1999, when I came here to go to school at AM, I came from Nairobi, Kenya, and I knew absolutely nothing about Black History Month. And so I came in August, and so when February came around, everyone's talking about Black History Month, and I'm like, Black History Month, I'm black, what's this about? And then I started learning about it, and I mean, for me, growing up in Kenya, we didn't know about, we didn't learn about the struggles, all the things that went on that really showed that humanity did not understand what it was to really just appreciate what the human being is. So when I started learning about all the, the different um, things that happened for, for blacks here in the United States, it really hurt me and I really felt like, wow, you know, this is a completely type of, different type of history than I learned when I was in school in Kenya. But then fast forward, I learned all about Black History Month and it really is a celebration of achievements. I learned about people who have taken something that they were not given and did something with it. They created a platform for people like me to be able to be seen by universities like Texas A&M University Corpus Christi. I mean, can you imagine if we didn't have the civil rights fighters that we had, would I, Lisa Wisner from Kenya, a black person from Kenya, be able to be seen by this university to come and play golf here? That would never have happened. So to me, Black History Month cele celebrated way much more than I think even what was being celebrated in America. For me, it was about the, the direction my legacy was being able to move into. The, the discovery of, wow, I am able to go there now because of the people who came.